This is why we are with Terminal Machine. It's a game which you can speed run in under five minutes if a glitch on the second level occurs. Not even joking, you could do the whole thing in five minutes. I don't know what causes the glitch for sure. Otherwise, I would do a speed run like that. I tried, but I can't. Uh, the game itself has no changing controls. You can put always run on, which you should. You have to do it every time because it doesn't save. Uh, it's 2003 by Asylum Games. Terminal Machine. Three levels long. Very glitchy. We're going to put it on easy because I'm not going to take this seriously. First off, let me show you like how fast you could do this first level. So here we go. This starts the game. And here we are. We're off. We're just going through this. We get shot at. You just jump by. It doesn't matter. You get hit once. That's alright. You got some armor and some health, so it's all good. So we go over here. There's a button. Two more to go. So I hit the button. Go through, back, around. Alright, and then we wait for this elevator. This is a slow part of the speedrun. So, I don't know what to do here. It's just like, you gotta wait. <laughs> you just gotta wait, 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 wait. And go for it. You get hurt a little bit if you jump early, but that's okay. There's another button right there. You click it. You run back. Click this to go back up. And you're up. And you're off. There we go. See? It's a delay. Alright. So we got two out of three buttons done. When you get the third button, a teleporter activates. And that's where the end of the level is. This is just showing how fast you can do it if you don't fight anybody and you just you go for broke and how you could really do this thing in five minutes. So and there you go. You can grab some help too. You don't need to really if you're speedrunning it usually, but I'm gonna do it just in case because I'm gonna do other stupid shit afterwards. Alright, so here we go. You hit that button and then you just go into that. You could jump across if you're risky. Uh but I'm not gonna bother. So what I wanna do now though, I wanna kill these people because they're pissing me off. Wow, okay. Holy fucking shit. 11 shots or something. Okay, where was I? Um. Right, I'm almost dead. That's where I am. So here's some health. There we go. Alright, so what I want to try to do is do some glitches down here. I experienced it once, I'm not sure how. Right now I'm kind of glitching on the elevator, everything's shaking more than it should, but well, that's different. Uh, if you go here, you can pick up some health, nothing special there. And then, uh, one time, yep, you can walk right out of the world. Look at that, right out of the world. Uh, just, just totally random glitch. You can walk right out of the world. So you could look around, look at all the... Just right out of the world. Man, it's crazy. Uh, there's no way back in, by the way. You're fucked after you do this. But look at that. You can go this far away. Not far at all. And what you need to do to get out of that is... Quick save, quick load. Quick save doesn't even do anything. Quick load basically says, here, you're at the start of the game again. And you gotta do everything again. So, you already saw how fast you could speed run it, basically. We're gonna do that again, real fast. Whoops. Mess that up a bit. You also go this way, too. I don't know this way as much, so... Let's just take it a little slower. Alright, there's some health over there. Let's grab those. You can, I don't think this way would be as fast if you'd actually try to speed run it, though, because you gotta go over here, hit this button, then you gotta back it up, then go through here. It doesn't feel nearly as fast. That's why I think the other way is better. So we go through here. Come on, go down before I fucking die. Oh, that missed. Oh well. Uh, then when we're down here, there's some other things I could like. Oh, look at this shit. I mean, there. this is one of the more interesting parts of the game. This lower area is funny enough. And if you jump too fast, you get so hurt, like you saw want to do that so you go over here you hit the button no big deal and if you hit that button all these enemies get freed up oh watch see I don't want none of that though so we're going back up so as you know I'm taking my time on this one the first time I could have done it you know a minute maybe two minutes you know it was very fast
And here we go, almost to the top. And go for it. Getting shot at. Like I said, I'm not trying to speedrun it so much this time. The first try was to show how fast you could do it. This one's more to show where the glitch is on the second level that sometimes occurs, but I don't know why or how. Boom. So you could jump right across. And so here we are. So what happens is on this level, let me grab these healths. You don't usually need to if you're speedrunning again, but um, I, I'm not going to try it because the glitch doesn't happen often. It happened once to me. So there's this thing right here. It's an elevator, basically. you got to kill those things before they kill you. Uh, there we go. We get on this thing. And sometimes this door will open. It should be locked, and it shouldn't open. Sometimes it'll just open right up, and you can go right through there and basically get to the end of the level. And then you're at the last level of the game in roughly two to three minutes, which is ridiculous. And those things are trying to kill me. I don't know what the world is supposed to be, but they're trying to kill me. So this thing is shut, which makes it... My speed run attempts, was, that's what made me give up, because I don't know exactly what causes that. It just happened once to me, and then never again. But that's basics of how weird this game is. Yo, you have different weapons, too. You got the blaster. Works pretty good. If you uh, alternate between normal fire and alt fire, you can shoot pretty rapidly. I think it's an exploit, but oh well. There's like a pterodactyl out here. I don't know why. There, there just, there's one. He explodes into a fireball when you kill him. I don't know why. It just does that. Maybe he's what causes it to open. If you kill him, maybe? Nope. Normally, you'd have to do other stuff, and I don't want to bother with it. So, that's the gist of it. You could speedrun this ridiculously fast. You have 200 seconds left to finish this level if I was to actually try. I'm not going to. Let's jump off a ledge. I'm still alive. How disappointing. Oh well. Until next time, this has been YBR screwing around stupidly. Uh, see ya.